night. The pit bulls that killed a chihuahua back in January are no longer with their owner tonight. 13 Action News reporter Gina Lazara spoke with both dog owners tonight who were in a heated argument that we caught on camera back when all of this happened. Gina is here now with these new developments right now. Gina. Steve, the pit bull owner says she did everything the county asked her to do, so she doesn't understand why her dogs were taken from her. The Chihuahua owner, on the other hand, is relieved to see some justice be done after her dog was violently killed. You probably remember this. You better roll. Your dog killed my dog. What do you have to say? Okay, excuse me. Like, what do you have to dog, say about it? The dog owners go at it, caught on 13 Action News cameras, after these pit bulls killed Bella the Chihuahua nearly two months ago in a South Valley neighborhood. And it's hard every day, you know, missing her, you know, reenacting the fact I watched her get eaten. Now those two pits are owned by Clark County. Animal control officers came to get the dogs on Friday. Their owner, Ann White, is a wreck without them. I've been crying every day, all day. Every day. I've been crying. Like, I'm like a nervous breakdown. And I'm going to commit suicide because they're my dog and they don't care. Gracia has been fighting for this since the day her dog was killed. She feels some justice has finally been served. The law does stand in this, in this county. I'm very, I'm impressed. To let her feel a little, what have I lost? Like the pain that I had when I lost my Bella and watched her eat me. Anne, on the other hand, says she did everything the county told her to do, including buying crates and dangerous dog insurance. She says she will appeal this and get her pits back. I miss them because that's the only thing I talk to. I don't go out the house. I don't do anything. I mean, this is what I do every day in the house. I'm told the two pit bulls will most likely be put down, but it's unclear exactly when that will happen. Gina Lazara, 13 Action News.